guys. Today's tips on how to take care of water snails. Also, before we get into this video, I just wanted to say I put my videos on Made for Kids because my brother has YouTube kids, but he's not allowed real YouTube. So, I want him to be able to watch my Shy's Hint. Size Critter Corner videos. Of course, I'm not going to put my main channel on YouTube Kids because I really like having to have comments on there, but this one is just going to be like this until my brother's old enough to get real YouTube. So anyways, let's get into the video. First up is a tank. You need a tank. That is common sense. So, yeah, we really do need to know that, but, yeah. Next is food. So, I actually didn't know that snails had to have food until my third snail, Ivy. And that's why my snail's name is Ivy Tupano. So, this is the kind of snail food that I've always had. My brother has the same, actually. Here, I'm going to go show you guys right now. Is this snail anyways? Anyways, I'm not actually supposed to be in this place. So yeah, we both use that sort of food for our snails. Mine's a snail skin stripey. And mine's is Ivy 2.0. So, I don't know where this is sold, but where I live, it's sold. So, clean, clear water. Fish produce less ammonia. So, no, snails cannot just eat algae. That was my theory when I did not know how to care for snails. Next are plants. So, snails can't just climb all around here without having a plant. So, I have this plant right here and then this one right here. And that's what I use for my snail right here. So, um... Oh. oh, I can do that. Okay. Um, yeah. So, plants. Rocks on the bottom of the tank. I have always had rocks. You need rocks. It's not just some potato chip floor. I don't put sand. And yeah. Try and make the snail's tank as natural as can be. No bright rocks or anything. And yeah, that's it for this video. Say bye, V2.0. Bye, guys.